Welcome to our show. I'm Hottie Hanna, Chairman and CEO of Howard Hanna Real Estate Services. Did you know that we're able to complete every step in your real estate process from the convenience of our neighborhood offices? That means you don't have to run all around town to buy or sell your home. We'll satisfy your real estate, mortgage, insurance, title, and closing needs from one location, saving you both time and money. Now I hope you enjoy today's Sunday Showcase of Homes. Most of the homes on today's show will be open this afternoon, as well as being available 24-7 on our website at howardhanna.com and by mobile at hannatogo.com. Custom built in 1987, this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath split-level home in Lower Paxton Township is still well-kept by its original owner. Natural light streams through the living room's bay windows, falling on its sleek new Perco floor. The formal dining room is ideal for friendly gatherings, with sliding doors out to a patio and level yard with oversized two-car garage. Newer appliances will simplify meal preparation in the spacious eat-in kitchen. Neutral colors will suit any decorating scheme and a home warranty and 100% money-back guarantee should set your mind at ease. A new roof was added in 2011 and the home is conveniently located just off Lingolstown Road, close to all amenities. Don't miss your chance for a personal tour this afternoon with host Mike Kivorkov. A covered front porch welcomes you home to this three-bedroom, one-and-a-half bath traditional in High Spire. You can move right in and enjoy 1,700 square feet of living space. Newer AC units see to your comfort, while new treatments frame newer windows. The hub of the home, the kitchen benefits from a new stove, and the main bath has been updated. A back patio permits access to a fence yard with two-car detached garage. Christine Farrell can tell you more and provide a personal tour. The neighborhood of Deer Path Woods is the setting for this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath traditional in Susquehanna Township. A covered front porch is your point of entry to an inviting family room. Crown molding and chair rail complement the custom paint of the formal dining room. Newer stainless steel appliances accompany the eat-in kitchen with a sliding door out to the rear deck. A home warranty and 100% money-back guarantee should provide peace of mind. Park in front of the two-car garage when you meet with Jennifer Jablonski this afternoon. The interior of this five-bedroom, four-bath split level in Mechanicsburg has been totally refinished. Crown molding encircles the dining room, resting on Brazilian cherry wood floors. The new kitchen combines custom cabinets, quartz counters, and stainless appliances. Bask in front of the family room's log-burning fireplace or head out sliding doors to a covered patio. A rear guest suite has its own full bath, kitchen, bedroom, and living room. Make time between 1 and 4 this afternoon for a personal tour with John Marshall. Located in the Windsor Farms community, this Susquehanna Township traditional has four bedrooms and two and a half baths. Crown molding and chair rail accent the newer flooring and paint of the dining room. Newer flooring and amenities will aid meal preparation in a generous eat-in kitchen. The family room displays a fireplace, one floor above a finished lower level. Parties and summer fun await on the back deck and above ground pool. Jennifer Jablonski is waiting for you this afternoon, so don't delay. Maintenance-free living can be yours at this two-bedroom, two-bath duplex in South Middleton Township. Custom blinds and draperies shade the windows of the living room. Sliding doors in the open dining room lead out to a side patio. Beside a breakfast nook, raised panel oak cabinetry fills the fully equipped kitchen. Clean and neat, the home and its attached garage are conveniently near town and travel. Visit this home between 1 and 4 today for a tour with host Randy Billman. Discover these chic Art Deco style condominium residences created and designed by the Barton Group. Five floors of units are perched above 10,000 square feet of neighborhood retail space. 43 total residences include studios, one and two bedroom, as loft floor plans. 12 foot ceilings add to the spacious open feel while floor to ceiling windows provide excellent city views. All residences have a private balcony and several other additional garden terraces. Using the LEED design approach, 1500 utilizes several green building and development practices to protect the health of the planet and the health of its residents. It will be a vibrant part of Midtown Harrisburg in close proximity to HACC Midtown Campus, Broad Street Market, the Marketplace Townhomes, Capitol Heights Riverfront Park, and countless restaurants, shops, and cultural and entertainment venues. To learn more, please contact Dave Winston and Derek Molin. Large, tastefully decorated spaces define this four-bedroom, two-and-a-half-bath colonial residence in Mechanicsburg. 
crown molding and chair rail line the walls of the formal dining room. The eat-in kitchen is beautifully appointed with a center island and a pantry, a perfect gathering space. The family room is capped by a whole wall gas brick fireplace. Breathe the fresh air on the covered deck and patio, overlooking a private rear yard. See it all for yourself between one and four today with Ted Baldwin. There are four bedrooms and two baths at this two-story Capitol Heights townhome with off-street parking. Built in 2012, it's constructed around an open floor plan with full basement. The eat-in kitchen employs a breakfast bar with pendulum lights, laminate floor and full set of appliances, and the ceramic tiled master bath. Split vanities face a private tub and shower area. You'll only be a few blocks away from Capitol Building and Susquehanna River. Explore this home to your heart's content between one and four with Marcy Robinson. Scenic vistas of the countryside envelop this private four bedroom, three and a half bath home in New Freedom. Cherry cabinets and granite counters enclose the kitchen's high-end stainless steel appliances. Cherry floors connect the pellet stove and wet dry bar of the sunken family room. The master suite is part of the first floor, and a guest suite occupies a separate wing. Hard paved patios and walks traverse the private 1.1 acre lot, also home to a three-car garage and a barn or workshop. For the chance to examine this home in person, please contact Lori Walker. Equipped with three bedrooms and two and a half baths, this Mediterranean-style home can be found in Colonial Hills. New carpet, paint, and windows are on display in the great room. Topped by a cathedral ceiling, warmed by gas heat and cooled by central air, the dining room faces a two-sided gas fireplace. Granite counters enfold the kitchen's new appliances, including a five-burner gas range, while you'll find a deck and patio out to the fenced yard. Learn about these and other fine features this afternoon with Todd Doyle. A home warranty will protect your investment in this sprawling two-bedroom, two-bath ranch in York. Hardwood floors stretch past the living room's bow window, leading up to a log-burning fireplace. A full set of included appliances will aid meal preparation in the eat-in kitchen. Guests will be impressed by the finished lower level and its inviting wet bar. A 14-foot enclosed breezeway lets you enjoy views of the level yard in all kinds of weather. Meet with Glenda Kane this afternoon and ask her about the 100% money-back guarantee. Nine-foot ceilings extend throughout the first floor of this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath condominium unit in West Hanover Township. An upper-level loft looks down onto the two-story great room, which has been wired for surround sound. Beautiful laminate flooring fills the formal dining room open to the kitchen for ease of entertaining. Gorgeous cherry cabinets combined with granite countertops, a glass mosaic backsplash, and a large pantry in the eat-in kitchen. A lighted tray ceiling tops the first-floor master suite, which connects to a walk-in closet and an elegant full bath. Geothermal heat and air conditioning see to your comfort and a security system provides peace of mind. Enjoy views of the woods from the all-season sunroom at today's open house with John Gajewski. This all-brick two-bedroom ranch is situated on almost half an acre in Susquehanna Township. A log-burning fireplace with an electric insert warms the hardwood living room. Replacement windows look in on the dining room and its adorable built-in cabinet. Quartz countertops rest on beautiful maple cabinets in the kitchen, connected to a walk-in pantry. The covered back porch looks out to a fenced yard and a storage shed with electrical service. Convenient near everything, this home will be open with Cindy Kampick. A covered front porch welcomes you to this tasteful four-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath colonial in New Freedom. Crown molding and chair rail encircle the hardwood formal dining room. Appliances are included with the kitchen and the basement has been fully roughed in. A brick fireplace brightens the family room, while a new roof keeps you warm and dry. The rear deck projects out onto a corner lot, half an acre of landscaped ground. Martin Heaps can tell you more and provide a personal tour today. The first of its kind, this totally unique ranch-style two-bedroom, two-bath townhome in New Cumberland offers one-level living at its finest. Part of the community of Old Orchard Hills, it incorporates all of Yink's uncompromising style, quality, and value. A brushed nickel chandelier tops the dining room, part of an open floor plan. The fantastic kitchen combines maple cabinets, peninsula host granite countertops, under cabinet lighting, stainless steel appliances, and a large pantry. Two units are ready for your individual tastes and selections, which pricing starts at 1949. A double walkthrough closet in the master suite permits access to a tile bath with maple cabinets and five-foot double shower. To learn more, please meet with Ted Baldwin or Carla Kleindienst. You know our sign, but maybe you don't know our services, like one-stop shopping. We take care of the mortgage. We take care of the insurance. 
We even have title and escrow services. Howard Hanna. We've thought of everything. Why rent when you can own this two-bedroom townhome in downtown Harrisburg? It's been totally renovated with new windows and carpeting, fresh paint, and all new electrical service. Included appliances are tucked back among the kitchen's new cabinets and sink. The bath has also been renovated with new fixtures and tiling and a new tub. You'll be only a short distance away from the river and the city's restaurants and entertainment. Don't miss your chance for a tour this afternoon with Ken Rohrer. Equipped with five bedrooms and two and a half baths, this charming brick home is part of the Red Lion School District. Beside a wall of windows, hardwood floors stretch toward the living room's log-burning fireplace. A door in the eat-in kitchen permits access to a maintenance-free deck, including the master suite, three bedrooms, and one and a half baths are located on the main level. New carpet fills the lower level rec room, outfitted with built-in shelves and gas fireplace. Don't miss your chance for a tour with Angela Sandmeyer. Between one and four today, Attention to detail is evident in every nook and cranny of this four-bedroom, three-and-a-half bath all-brick home in Lower Paxton Township. There are seven climate-controlled heating zones and five zones for cooling, ensuring a comfortable temperature. The custom Rut Martin Kitchen comes complete with a sub-zero refrigerator, two Fisher Pagel dishwashers, two refrigerator drawers, two wall ovens, two sinks, and a countertop range set in a granite-topped island. Italian tile leads into the adjacent breakfast area, which offers creamy French country cabinetry and seating for 8 to 10. Cherry bookshelves line the walls of the stately private office or study, which rests on a radiant heated floor. The master suite is a separate living area with sitting area, two walk-in closets, and an elegant full bath. For more information on this impressive home, meet with Jody Diego this afternoon. Three bedrooms, two full and two half baths are among the 3,000 square feet of living space in this home in Shrewsbury. High ceilings and hardwood floors connect the open living and dining rooms. In total, the home provides three floors of finished living space, all kept in outstanding condition. Prepare home cooking in the cherry kitchen and then sample it in the nearby breakfast area. Custom shelving borders an office area while the game room features a theater system. There's much more, so be sure to visit this afternoon's open house with Martin Heaps. Flat in brick and siding, this stately two-bedroom, two-bath Cape Cod is set in New Cumberland. A hardwood living room is only the beginning of 1,900 square feet of living space. Chair rail encircles the dining room and a home warranty provides peace of mind. Prepare meals in the spacious kitchen and then relax in the front of the yard's decorative pond. One full bath can be found on each level and in addition could serve as a guest suite. Stop by this afternoon's open house and see it for yourself with Joyce Fenstermacher. You'll fall in love with this five-bedroom, three-and-a-half bath colonial home in Windsor Township. Hardwood floors fill the dining room encircled by crown molding and chair rail. Skylights shine down on the kitchen and its Gen Air stove and walk-in pantry. A gas fireplace and built-in bookshelf rise to meet the vaulted ceiling of the living room. To the rear, discover a spacious deck, fenced play area, and a heated in-ground pool. Direct all of your questions to Brenda Riddle at this afternoon's open house. Dramatic entry stairs guide you up to the main level of this three-bedroom, two-bath residence in Edders. A vaulted ceiling towers above the living room and its Brazilian cherry floors. The open floor plan continues into an eat-in kitchen resting on ceramic tile. The interior has been professionally painted and wall-to-wall -wall carpet fills the family room. Follow sliding doors out to a patio and professionally landscaped yard. Sue Kent can answer all your questions and provide a personal tour. Experience gracious living along the riverfront at this one-bedroom unit in historic Riverview Manor. Completely renovated five years ago, it combines modern updates and historic charms. Large windows emit natural light, and Brazilian cherry floors fill the dining room. The kitchen features granite countertops and stainless steel appliances. Building amenities include off-street parking, fitness center, community room, and a rooftop sun deck. See it all for yourself this afternoon with Diane Lopatic. This 18th century Carlisle home with four bedrooms and two and a half baths was Victorianized in 1996. Wooden floors, original fireplace mantles, and attractive built-ins are present throughout. A garden window stands above the kitchen's double sink, while a pantry provides extra storage. The master bedroom adjoins a private balcony and a bath with clawfoot tub and separate shower. The patio is perched atop the fenced yard, 
also home to a two-car detached garage. Experience the period charm and style yourself with the help of Jan Vero. A stone front lends curb appeal to this meticulously maintained four-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath traditional in Dillsburg. Pillars frame the entry to the formal dining room, topped by a tray ceiling with crown molding. Featuring stainless appliances and oversized island, the kitchen connects to a butler's pantry. The master suite features dual walk-in closets and an elegant private bath. The ceramic tiled sunroom transitions out to a wraparound Drex deck and stamped concrete patio. Meet with Brenda Albright this afternoon and ask about the 100% money-back guarantee. Close to all the best features of Boiling Springs, this traditional has three bedrooms and one and a half baths. Sliding doors connect the laminate floor dining room to a spacious rear deck. Ceramic tile supports the kitchen's pantry and stainless appliances. Crown molding and chair rail border the family room, centered on a gas fireplace. Relax in the lower level rec room or take advantage of nearby parks and walking trails. For more information and a personal tour, meet with William Rudge. A natural stone facade puts a pretty face on this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath villa at the foot of the Blue Mountains. Follow maple cherry hardwood floors through a custom arched entry into the dining room. Skylights punctuate the cathedral ceiling of the great room, whose sliding doors lead to the deck. The kitchen employs granite counter, stainless steel appliances, and built-in wine rack and wine refrigerator. Wired for surround sound, the oversized loft has a custom cutout for a TV. Experience this home and its scenic mountain views this afternoon with Bob Stammel. What more could you want than this four-bedroom, three-and-a-half bath traditional home in Mechanicsburg? A tiled foyer welcomes you to the two-story great room, topped by a cathedral ceiling. On cold winter nights, curl up in front of an inviting gas fireplace. The master suite and its walk-in closet and elegant full bath are conveniently located on the first floor. The community of Trindle Station is close to schools and only a short commute from major roads. Doug Heinemann would be pleased to answer your questions and provide a personal tour. Pride of ownership is apparent at this brick four-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath colonial in the Dover School District. Hardwood floors are present throughout, stretching past two log-burning fireplaces. Appliances are included with the eat-in kitchen, located beside a first-floor den. The finished lower-level family room would be ideal for entertaining. A beautiful Pine Four Seasons room overlooks a private and serene fenced backyard. This home is ready for you to move right in, so take a tour today with Angela Santmeyer. A corner lot in Carlisle is a setting for this four-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath traditional home. Crown molding and hardwood floors unite the formal living and dining rooms, while the family room is focused on a cozy gas fireplace. Beside a breakfast area, attractive cabinets provide ample storage in the kitchen. The spacious master suite is enhanced by a bath with double vanities, jetted tub, and a separate shower. A tour this afternoon with Sharon Reifsnyder should tell you all you need to know. This four-bedroom, three-bath townhome is in a well-maintained residence in a quiet Dover community. Its open layout begins with vaulted living room warmed by a gas fireplace. Sit at the bar area of the vinyl-floored kitchen, outfitted with stainless steel appliances. Adjacent to a full bath, the master suite also features door to a rear deck. The daylight lower level is a fully finished space with two additional bedrooms and a large living area. Satisfy your curiosity. Meet with Nicole Meaton between 1 and 4 today. 1.76 country acres in Elizabethtown surround this three-bedroom, three-bath traditional. The home is well-maintained and nicely designed with a clean, open floor plan. Recent updates include a new roof and kitchen, new low-E windows, and a newer furnace. Zoned heating and cooling see to your comfort, and all three full baths have been remodeled. The newer deck transitions out to a level yard only minutes from Hershey and Routes 743 and 283. For more information and a personal tour, Meet with Jackie Henry this afternoon. Breathtaking views surround this four-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath traditional home on 3.8 acres in Carlisle. Hardwood floors fill the dining room, whose windows are shaded by attractive treatments. The country kitchen makes use of the step-up bar and a breakfast area. Nearby in the living room, wall-to-wall -wall carpet radiates out from the living room's gas fireplace. A first-floor laundry and first-floor master suite will simplify day-to-day -day logistics. Two garages with parking for a total of four cars are just one more advantage of this home. Open with Michael Deal. A level lot in Lebanon sets the stage for this quaint two-bedroom, two-bath ranch home. Its open layout includes almost 1,500 square feet of living space. A tile backsplash is a cheerful touch in this country-style eat-in kitchen. French doors open to a four-season sunroom, one level above a large, unfinished basement. Breathe the fresh air on the back patio, part of a level, fenced-in yard. 
Kelly Smith can tell you more and provide a personal tour today. This private five bedroom, three and a half bath traditional is a private retreat in Lower Paxton Township. Appliances are included with the Eden kitchen, whose bay windows frame wooded views. On cold winter nights, curl up in the front of the family room's log burning stone fireplace. The master suite connects to a deck and a guest suite has its own kitchen, living area and full bath. More than an acre of land surrounds the home and two garages provide parking for a total of four cars. Discover these and other fine features with the help of John Marshall. Extra yard space is available at this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath end unit in Hampton Township. New carpet leads up to a corner fireplace in the living room, brightened by extra windows. Chow rail encircles a dining room resting on a new wood-look ceramic tile floor. The kitchen combines new cabinets and countertops with new electric range and a sink with high-end faucet. A storage room is just off the rear deck and residents will appreciate a community pool. Make time this afternoon for a personal tour with Linda Harper. Part of a cul-de-sac in York, this five-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath colonial home is a genuine showstopper. Custom wainscoting makes a first-grade impression, extending throughout the first floor. Double corner cabinets accompany a floor-to-ceiling stone gas fireplace in the living room. Ceramic tile covers the walls and floor of the finished game room. A two-tiered deck with granite-topped bar faces a landscaped yard with drip irrigation and a fish pond. For more information on this striking home, contact Glenda Kane. Many updates enhance this custom-built six-bedroom, three-and-a-half bath contemporary home in Glen Rock. Hardwood floors with custom inlays stretch toward the sunken living room's log-burning fireplace. The gourmet kitchen employs stainless steel appliances, including a double wall oven and wine cooler. The bathrooms have been upgraded with custom tile work, jacuzzi tub, and a separate shower. A generous rear patio looks out across 2.59 acres of private ground. For a complete tour this afternoon, meet with Gina Baum between 1 and 4. This bright and open end unit in Timberview is only minutes from shopping, downtown, and major highways. Neutral paint and carpeting in the living room will be sure to suit any decorating scheme. Enjoy home cooking in the dining room and then breathe the fresh air on a private back patio. Fronted by a breakfast bar with room for four, the kitchen rests on laminate flooring. The pride of ownership at this unit will be readily apparent at today's open house with John Garger. The open floor plan of this well-maintained townhome includes three bedrooms and two full baths. A cathedral ceiling soars above the living room, which flows into a formal dining room. The ceramic tiled kitchen benefits from a pantry and morning room. Additional storage is available in the finished basement, which has been totally remodeled. The rear deck and covered patio let you survey protected woods traversed by a walking path. To learn about these and other fine features, meet with Catherine Marlier between 1 and 4. Located in the development of Netherby, this traditional home features three bedrooms and two and a half baths. Wall-to-wall -wall carpet fills the vaulted living room, capped by a gas fireplace. The quality work of CNC construction is evident throughout the open floor plan. Cherry cabinets team up with granite counters and stainless appliances in the custom kitchen. The first floor master suite connects to a walk-in closet and generous full bath. To learn about this residence and other homes of Netherby, meet with Michael Deal. Only a short distance from the park, this four-bedroom, one-and-a-half bath colonial is located in Dallas Town. The interior of the home consists of spacious rooms with plenty of closets and storage. A large front picture window admits natural light to the oversized living room. Appliances are included with the eat-in kitchen and ideal workspace. The breakfast area's window looks out at a yard with a patio and fish pond. A ceramic tiled four-season room is the finishing touch at this home, open with Glenda Kane. Beautifully appointed by Caracato Brothers, this traditional home on a half-acre corner lot in Lower Paxton Township includes four bedrooms and five full baths. Decorative columns frame the transition into the formal dining room, topped by a tray ceiling with indirect lighting. Maple cabinets support Corian countertops in the gourmet kitchen, which also employs a breakfast bar and pull-out garbage and recycling bins. A cathedral ceiling towers above the two-story great room while a pair of arched windows flanks its central gas fireplace. Set off by itself in the home's east wing, the master suite includes ceramic tile bath with double bowl vanity, double shower, and large whirlpool tub. Guests will be impressed by the finished lower level thanks to a custom oak wet bar, a game room, and a full bath. 
Don't miss your chance to examine this home in person thanks to Bonnie Patemi. A beautiful example of historical preservation, this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath farmhouse in Shippensburg dates back to 1798. The interior displays hardwood floors and rustic textures like stone and exposed brick. In leisure time, take a dip in the in-ground pool or raise lush cultivars in the greenhouse. The 12.4 acres of ground are also home to a period train car that serves as a pool house, as well as two separate barns, a gazebo, and a detached garage. For more information and the chance to take a personal tour, please contact Doug Heinemann. Encompassing more than 4,000 square feet, this three-bedroom, two-and-a-half bath stone ranch in Middle Paxton Township is one of a kind. A 13-foot ceiling stands above the family room and its wet bar and see-through fireplace. Every interior detail, such as 14-foot ceilings and rosewood floors, have been hand-selected. The kitchen employs granite counters, six-burner Viking gas cooktop, three ovens, and a butler's pantry. Situated on 10 acres, the home is very private, yet only 15 minutes from downtown Harrisburg. Don't miss this opportunity for a first-hand visit today with Laura Sullivan. Nestled amid 3.5 acres in the Blue Mountains, this exquisite six-bedroom estate combines the amenities of a five-star resort with old-world charm, comfort, and style. Discerning buyers will appreciate the interior's impeccable craftsmanship and panoramic views of Harrisburg Country Club and the Susquehanna River. The chef-inspired kitchen boasts hand-hewn wooden cabinetry, granite counters, backsplashes imported from Italy, and appliances by Gaganal, Meal, Wolf, and Sub-Zero. Constructed of gorgeous stone masonry, the home is topped by a slate roof with copper accents and intriguing roof lines. Pass through a gallery to find the perfect master suite for relaxation and solitude. Hardscapes permit access to a heated pool and tennis court, and the grounds include more than 10,000 different planted landscape items. To learn more about this impeccable estate and arrange a personal tour, please contact Dick Tucker.